We have Pepe is up by 6.3%. Uh, Dog with a hat is up by 8%. So yes, guys, we are looking fairly healthy only for the meantime, because I reckon as long as Bitcoin can hold the level right now and hopefully do come back up to retest these levels right up here, which will put the Bitcoin price at $63,000. Then guys, I can only imagine that whichever meme points you're holding will in fact go up by more than 20%. So anyway, once again, and welcome back to the Toro Crypto for another video. Let's quickly jump into some of the OG memes that we've been discussing in the past. So why don't we crack on with Chloe. Chloe so far has in fact been dropping like as hot, quite literally. The market cap is currently at $186,000. However, we are seeing some moves to the upside. I still believe in this bull cycle, we are going to see a huge move coming in for Sada and Chloe, and then we're going to drop back down. So it's always worth trying to capitalize on the bigger moves. I am not shilling, nor am I saying that these memes will stay up forever at the highest price. But whilst the price is still low, it is always worth trying to capitalize on the potential gains. This is not financial advice, it's showing you exactly what I'm doing so you don't miss out on much of the gains and helping you not to do too much research by me doing research for you. So let's take a look at the chart. Bear in mind that guys, this is on a four hour chart and we are looking not too shabby because if I, draw the chart for you now this here looks very 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 juicy because we're in fact doing a rounding up from the top level and now it's looking like we could do something like this this could be an extremely bullish move because ultimately once we do break up from a certain level which i'm just trying to draw for you right now once we do break above this level here then we should be heading away back up to the top. Just bear in mind guys that there are so many levels that we first need to break. First of which would be this one over here. Then the next one will be over here. And the list continues. But I'm not going to draw too many lines to throw you guys off at all. So I'm going to make things nice and simple. The minute we do break up from here, we should be expecting a much more higher moves at, or at least the retest back up to the last all-time highs which will be right up here now if that was to happen at least for the short term to possibly mid but if you are daring enough to be able to hold for the longest and your risk tolerance are really high then in fact at least from here to there you should be looking at 478 uh, 100 percent move to the upside which means that is a nearly 5x return. Now, let's say, for example, you're not exactly bullish on this project. You can take your 5x from Sada and Chloe, and then you can reinvest that into or add more of your bags into any of your favorites. And then you can just rinse and repeat or add more to your bigger bags for that bull run. Also, guys, please excuse my um, voice today because in my day job, I do a lot of, a lot of talking, sometimes even shouting. That's why I sound a bit out of breath. I'm not really out of breath, just losing voice. But anyway, the current market cap is at $168,000. We can still 10x from here, which will put the market cap only at $1.8 million. It might be worth holding it for your 10x because it won't be long for us to reach there. And then once you do get your 10x gains, you can easily use your gains and then recycle it into your main hodling bags. But anyway, that just, that's only just one strategy. So why don't we move on to the next OG token, which is going to be Black Cock Inu. I know a lot of people that don't really care too much about Black Cock Inu anymore, or people who held Black Cock Inu gave up on a project and moved along. I don't blame anyone for thinking however way they choose to think, but just remember guys, I'm a YouTube content creator, so therefore I still have people that want to see these type of videos. If you don't want to see them, do me a favor. If you go to my timeline, or timestamp you will see which tokens that you like to go and watch i strongly recommend you in that case head over to my timestamp so you can find the meme coins that you want to watch otherwise 
Blackhawk Inu. This is for your OG fans. All right, so looking at the chart, I wouldn't say it's the end of the world. However, I am not overly mega bullish on this project anymore. However, it that doesn't take away the fact that you can't trade this because I believe you still can. All we got to do is wait until we break this level right up here. And then once we do break this level, then I reckon it's good to go right up here. We just need to break the white resistance line, turn that into support. Then I'll be looking for a trade, something like this. Three, two, one. Yep, something like this, which will give me roughly around about 143% move to the upside. However, we just need to be breaking what at least looking like we're about to break the resistance line, turn into support, in order for me to see that for 143% move to the upside. Once we do break this level up here and we continue our way to the top, then yes, if you are still bullish on this project, I'll be waiting for a break up from here. Then you should be able to see that we should be on our way back up to roughly around about that 143% and that if you've been holding this for the longest is up to you guys and what you do with your money but ultimately we could even quite possibly see well actually I do still reckon we could still get back to the last all-time highs but how much more higher can we go I'm not too sure guys let me just pull out the measuring tool and measured to the last all-time highs, still roughly around about 1,498% move to the upside. That is still not too shabby. That is still not too bad. So if you put in, let's say, $1,000, you'll come out with $14,000. So that's pretty, pretty, that's, that's okay. You could do better with most other memes, but if you're happy to stick with black cock in you and see what happens thereafter what, what i mean by thereafter is once we do break up in the last all-time highs then that's for you to do your own research but i'm just putting this video out because i know some of my subscribers do in fact like black cock in you and i need to show them more respect by at least doing a little bit of black cock in you speaking of which showing a bit of respect by at least showing my subscribers what they would like to see. And once again, guys, you know, just go to my timestamp, find the tokens that you're mostly interested in. But right now, we are going to head to one of the OG memes that we talk about in this channel for the longest. And that is going to be, once I do find it, all right, here it is, DiCaprio Cheese Token. Now, I haven't spoken about the Capri Cheese Token for the longest. In fact, the market cap was roughly around about nearly $4 million at one point. But now it's down to 500000 Oof, took a massive hit. Either way. Oof, and all that mad drawings. Mind you, this is from a long time ago. Let me just get rid of all the drawings. All right. Hmm. Maybe the Cafe Cheese Token would in fact do much better than Blackcock in you. In fact, I do believe that there are, that maybe this is actually a much better option. Maybe Cheese Token is in fact a lot more better option than your Blackcock in you. The chart is looking not too shabby actually. If you're looking for a trade, this could be a pretty decent one. So if you get in now, for instance, because now it looks like we have a somewhat of a green engulfing candle forming right over here. Just bear in mind that's on a daily. The day has not finished yet by any means at all. And if we do target right back to this level up here, that will give you 290% move to the upside. But once we do crack this level right up here, the next one will be right up here at 645 hundred percent that's over 6x your trade or should we say portfolio then the next one will be hmm, interesting at least anywhere between 1651 or even hmm, 2000 just over 2000 percent 
which is not too shabby. Maybe cheese token is worth mentioning in my future videos because still the Capio Cheers meme has been circulating online for many years now, really popular. People still use the meme for multiple different things and it could in fact do really well. There's a couple of things I'd like to do though on this video. Uh, when I come down to Cheers token, let's quickly go over to their website and see what's been going on. I haven't been on their website now for the longest. I want to see what they have in store for us and in latest updates and etc. Okay, introduction being audited, fair enough, more memes are propping up. Poof. Still the same old thing, let's have a look at the red map. Okay, so we should easily be on the second stage of the roadmap of release of games, a complete marketing push, listing on major exchanges, release of games to be determined. Then number three, complete major listings for community meetups for 2025. Hmm. I don't know guys, so let me just quickly check on there. Let's have a look on their Twitter, see what's popping in their Twitter X, should I say. They still have 3,000 followers, which is not too bad. Oh my gosh, the last post was back in April the 11th. That is a long time ago. This post here was back in May. <laughs> That's quite funny, actually. This one right here. Let's have a look. Let's have a look what's the latest. What's the latest one? <laughs> It's nothing just but a meme, quite literally. 30th of April, 28, 28, 28. Yeah, nothing much has come out of from Cheers token as of yet. So their social media presence is not too strong, if you ask me. They're just quite literally pushing everything that seems to be meme and not showing any further on their on their roadmaps. But anyway, this could be worth taking a risk, I don't know, but at the end of the day, there's plenty of more memes that I can choose to invest my money on and also your money on as well. But this could be worth, I don't know, this could be worth putting in maybe like several hundred dollars and see how they perform in the bull season. It is the Caprio of the room and that meme. And because memes, and this could be no different to Chloe as well as Success Kid, so you just don't know how well potentially any of these memes will do. So it might be worth just putting away two, three hundred dollars and literally just forget about it, because you can still quite easily make, you know, two thousand percent, which means that's like twenty x return. If you get anything more than that, great. If not, then it is what it is. That's why it's always worth just taking a risk because you just don't know how much you could actually make from it, but you're still guaranteed to make something at least. Whether we do more than 1,000x, well, I really doubt it. If we can get at least, let's say, 100x, then yeah, you'll be laughing. But I'll, I'll keep it now what goes on with the Gabriel Cheese token and we can take it from there. Now let's go check up on Kitty because Kitty has also taken a huge battering for the past several weeks. At one point, the market cap was in fact 14 mil, and now we dropped down to 3.39 million dollar market cap. Ooh, well, let's go check out their charts. Okay, so for the daily, it still looks more. Well, it's actually looking pretty bullish, if you ask me. Huh, still looking pretty, pretty bullish. Let's get rid of all the lines. All right, so it looks like this is a lot more healthier than the last two charts. Once we do break this level right up here, then I reckon we are good to go. So once we break here, then we should be good to go to go to a much more higher price. Once we smash through there, the first leg up should be 354% to move to the upside. Then the last one should be 
at 498% mu to the upside. Literally almost 5x all in all. No. It might be worth DCA your way in because I do believe the cat memes will in fact take off in this bull season. But anyway, guys, you let me know whether you're bullish on Kitty. But if we could take a look at the tokenomics 3.39 million, 10x from here, 33 million, 100x from here, 339 million, and then 1000x at three point, potentially 3.3. Nine billion dollar market cap. You let me know whether you believe that we can go up to that three point three nine billion dollar market cap. Right, here's Teddy, guys. Ted is not doing too shabby. My next video, I will do. I think Ted Cash or Cash Ted is their other meme token. So I'll start doing that from later on video. That is for sure. And later on, I'll be doing pickle as well. So guys, I haven't forgotten. I'll do. Ted Cash and become on my next video. So let's quickly dive into Ted. Ted is looking, yeah, to be fair, that's not too bad of a shape of the chart. All right, so all we got to do here is keep an eye on the moment that we do break up from this level right up here, because once we break there, then we should continue our way to the upside. However, I am still bullish on this project, so I'll be looking to load up a lot more around about this level down here, because whenever we dip, the rule should always be, or the rule of thumb should always be, if we dip much more harder or lower to down these areas, I'll be looking to add a lot more of my bags. So now we're literally at the level now. I'll be adding more to my bags right now. And even if I decide to sell my bags from here to there, with a the view of taking my trades from up here, you'll be up by 353% move to the upside. Just this move from here to there, depending how much money you choose to invest right down there. Remember guys, it's not financial advice, then you can walk away with more than 348% move to the upside. However, overall structurally of the chart, I do believe we can quite easily hit two of the last all time highs. If I was to pull out the measuring tool from the current price, which is literally the bottom of the bottom, and we'll take profit right from the top of there, that's at 1,064% move to the upside. However, let's quickly dive into their market cap is at $146,000. 10x from here is in fact a $1.46 million market cap. 100x, it will be at $14.6 million. And then if we were to see 1,000x, guys, that's only $146 million market cap. So that is just a quick technical analysis on the chart in terms of where to enter. And here's my prediction by checking on the market cap. So let's move on to the last one and that'll be it for the video. All right, guys, so we're gonna take a look at LFGO because we haven't done a deep dive or even a quick video on LFGO. So far we are looking, all right, we're not looking too bad. We're shaping up pretty well. As long as we stay above the, let me change this color here. As long as we stay above this support line, which we're going to turn it into red. And if we continue our way to the upside, then guys, the most important key area that we need to break is this level right up here. Only until we break this level there, then we should be expecting a much more bigger price and move to the much more higher high. Basically right up here. So that means currently, if we pull out the measuring tool and we measure from the current price, in order for us to get back to the last all-time highs, that's that 362% move to the upside. So what does that mean? That means around about this area, I'll be looking to add a lot more of my bags, just in case if we do fall much further down to below the support line, that means the next leg down should be right down here. Let's just drag this one down. And this could be the last level of support. As long as we don't reach back down here, then we should be good to go to continue our way to the upside. So I'll be locking up a lot more of my bags and adding more to my bags right over here with the view of getting back up to this level right up here at around about two cents mark. Now, how about we change the chart price into the price versus the market cap? So in order for us to get back up to this level up here, the market cap will need to get 224 million dollar market cap and currently we are at 5.4 this would be a decent right to the top i still believe that 
LFGO has a decent spot within the meme space and could do a lot more. So that means in order for us to see a 10x from here, market cap will need to get to $54 million market cap. If we see a 100x, market cap will need to get to $541 million. And then if, if we see a 1000x, then the market cap will need to get to 5.4 billion dollar market cap so there you have it guys you have my predictions some of my alpha plays and also some of the most riskiest play that might be not even worth doing but i'll leave it all down to you to do your own research and figure out which one best suits you but anyway as always leave your comments within the comment section and if you haven't done so already guys always keep your eye on what happens with the rest of the charts but most importantly always check what bitcoin is doing and if you haven't done so already, give me a like, subscribe, hit the bell notification to be updated for all of my content and videos. Scroll down, check out my last few videos, and I will see you all in the next